Banky W joins PDP set to run for House of Reps. Will Smith resigns from academy membership over Chris Rock's slap. 2022 Grammys, Whiskey loses out in both categories. He's nominated. Hi everyone and welcome to STV's News Extra, your one-stop shop for everything that's trending. First up, our first story is all about Banky W deciding to go with the big boys. He's joining PDP and he intends to run for the House of Representatives in the forthcoming elections. Here's what is happening. He's also declared his intention to contest for the seat of ATOSA federal constituency in the House of Representatives in the 2023 general elections. He made the announcement on his Twitter handle on Friday where he recounted how he, in the past years, has been actively engaged in community service and attempted to be part of the solutions to the problems of his constituents. Well, this seems to be a welcome development because it seems like if you're not in one of the major parties, the chances of you getting into office it's very slim and um, Banky seems to be someone who is involved in the grassroots politics. I hope he makes the best use of his opportunity and if he eventually gets into office because celebrities go into politics, it's a whole ball game entirely. So I hope he knows his onions and we wish him all the best. And on to our next story. This story has been buzzing for the past few weeks since it's happened. And finally, Will Smith has stepped down from the academy over the slap. Yeah, it seems like one slap can change your entire life. Here's the full story. The Hollywood star who slapped Chris Rock after the comedian made a stage joke about Jada Pinkett, his wife. His response received mixed reactions from Hollywood stakeholders, some of whom condemned the assault. Many critics also called for his sanction while the actor faces possible expulsion or suspension over the issue. However, in a statement on Friday, he resigned from the academy after describing his move as inexcusable. All right, so... It seems that um, a lot of stakeholders are not happy about the situation. It's best that he steps down and hoping that his Oscar will not be taken from him and other sanctions will not be put in place because Will Smith is a very great guy. We all make mistakes and this seems to be an error. I know it can happen to the best of anyone, but I'm rooting for Will Smith in one way or the other. Doesn't excuse the act. It is wrong and sanctions should definitely be put in place. And on to our last story. I was the Grammys over the weekend and Whiskey did not win in any of the categories that he was nominated for. Here's what happened. The 2022 Grammy Awards aired on Sunday and Whiskey was put up in the best global music performance category for Essence, his collaboration with Thames. His Made in Lagos and Legacy by Femi and Made Kuti were up in the best global music album category. However, Whiskey lost to Kidejo, the Beninese singer in the first category and to Aruf Aftab, the Pakistani vocalist in the second. All right, so I think there are many more nominations ahead for Whiskey. They should not give up hope. Um, also, a big congratulations to all the winners. I know it's not easy for this type of category, especially when there's someone who seems to have been winning over and over and over. Whiskey is big all over the world, and <laughs> there's still so many more Grammys, and it's not even all about the Grammys. Even if you don't win a Grammy, you're still very successful. And on that note, it's a wrap on SCB's News Extra. For more of these stories, make sure you go to our YouTube page on Silverbird TV or on our website at silverbirdtv.com. Plus, don't forget to follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram at Silverbird TV. I am Tolu at Sassinulu. I will see you next time.